Kuiper Belt and Oort Cloud. The solar system's Kuiper Belt is beyond Neptune's orbit and home to Pluto and a slew of other icy bodies. The Kuiper Belt is a large region in the cold, outer reaches of our solar system beyond the orbit of Neptune from about 30 to 55 AU. It is a thick disk or donut-shaped ring or area of icy objects. Similar to the asteroid belt, the Kuiper Belt is a region of leftovers from the solar system's early history. It is sometimes called the third zone of the solar system. Our solar system has three zones, the inner zone of terrestrial planets, middle zone of gas giants, and a third zone called the Kuiper Belt. The inner, main region of the Kuiper Belt ends around 50 AU, from the Sun overlapping the outer edge of the main part of the Kuiper Belt is a second region called the Scattered Disk, which continues outward to nearly 1000 AU, with some bodies on orbits that go even farther beyond. The region is named for astronomer Gerard Kuiper, who published a scientific paper in 1951 that speculated about objects beyond Pluto. Astronomer Kenneth Edgeworth also mentioned objects beyond Pluto in papers he published in the 1940s, and thus it's sometimes referred to as the Edgeworth-Kuiper Belt. However, neither of the two discovered this region. Some prefer to call it the Transneptunian region, and refer to Kuiper Belt objects, KBOs, as Transneptunian objects or TNOs. The Kuiper Belt is home to most of the objects that astronomers generally accept as dwarf planets such as Pluto, Haumea, and Makimaki. Pluto is the largest and most massive member in this region. Scattered Disk is a sparsely populated region that stretches far beyond the main part of the Kuiper Belt. The scattered disk objects, or SDOs, generally have highly eccentric orbits. Some of them may come as close as 30 AU, and can go beyond 1000 AU. The innermost portion of the scattered disk overlaps with a torus-shaped region of the Kuiper Belt, but its outer limits reach much farther away from the Sun and farther above and below the ecliptic. The scattered disk gives the donut-shaped classical Kuiper belt a much wider and thicker extent. Dwarf planet Eris lies in this region and is the largest member. Some astronomers talk about the Kuiper belt and scattered disk as separate regions, although their boundaries overlap and are linked together in a number of ways. The literature is inconsistent in the use of the phrases scattered disk and Kuiper belt. For some, both are distinct populations, for others, the scattered disk is part of the Kuiper belt. Some authors may even switch between these two uses in a single publication. The Oort Cloud, also known as the Opic Oort Cloud, is a predicted collection of icy objects farther away than everything else in the solar system. Oort Cloud is believed to be a giant spherical shell surrounding the Sun, planets, and Kuiper Belt objects. It's like a big, thick bubble around our solar system, made of icy, comet-like objects and likely occupies space at a distance between about 2,000 and 100,000 AU from the Sun. It is divided into two regions, a disk-shaped inner Oort cloud and a spherical outer Oort cloud. Both regions lie beyond the heliosphere and are in interstellar space. The inner edge is thought to be between 2,000 and 5,000 AU from the Sun. The outer edge might be 10,000 or even 100,000 AU from the Sun. The outer extent of the Oort cloud is considered to be the edge of our solar system, where the Sun's physical and gravitational influence ends. The Oort cloud, or Opicord cloud, is named for Jan Oort, the Dutch astronomer who predicted its existence in the 1950s and Estonian astronomer Ernst Opik who theorized its existence way back in 1930s. No confirmed direct observations of the Oort cloud have been made so far. 
Kuiper Belt and Oort Cloud. There are many places in the solar system where icy bodies congregate, the asteroid belt roughly between Jupiter and Mars, top, the donut-shaped Kuiper Belt beyond the gas giant planets, middle, and the most distant zone, the Oort Cloud, bottom. Location in the Heliosphere and Interstellar Medium Kuiper Belt Oort Cloud